That's true, uh, Matt, uh, for a simple reason that the middle seat free provides no social distancing whatsoever. You're only two and a half feet away from the per between the window and the aisle seat. The person behind you in the aisle seat and in front of you in the aisle seat is even less than two and a half feet away. You can't have social distancing on board an aircraft in the same way you can't manage it in a train or a London underground. And I think we will need different measures for, for you know, sensible measures, which would be temperature checks at the airports. Anybody who has a temperature higher than 38 degrees would be refused entry. Uh, all passengers on board and our staff, the cabin crew, will be wearing face coverings, face masks, etc. Aircraft being disinfected daily uh, each night. That would provide enormous, I think, uh, barriers to the spread of COVID-19. But we're also going to have to have some common sense measures. You can't run the London Underground or train services or train or, or planes with social distancing measures. I mean, there's no social distancing in an airport terminal. It's simply not possible. You can't board an aircraft or deplane an aircraft with social distancing. So I think masks, temperature checks and disinfectants are the way forward. That's how the Asian airlines have already returned to uh, flight services uh, over there. And you remember the Chinese airlines are now running at about 70% of their pre-COVID schedule. So it will bounce back. And I think traffic numbers will bounce back because the airlines will engage in very aggressive discounting led by Lufthansa Air France with the benefit of you know, 30 billion of state aid. Uh, we'll be discounting aggressively. So uh, it, there will be lots of price incentives for passengers. Um, and I think, but we will all be taking sensible precautions like temperature checks and face masks to ensure that what are after all short haul flights, I mean, our average flight duration is one hour and 15 minutes. There will not be a spread of COVID-19 on board any short haul flights if these sensible measures are taken.